be good from Trelaw, and it is to Giles. Take the mark. Giles weaves his way through some traffic and some magic. Long ball in from Edwards towards full forward. Giles knows how to find the goals, and he shows that again. Yeah, it's been my fourth club. Um, obviously, learned a lot of things along the way. I was drafted when I was 17 to Port, so it's you know it was 10 years ago. So as much as you you train physically and mentally and all those sort of things, you, you learn a lot of resilience and um, you pick up a lot of things along the way with the players that you play with. Um, you know, I've been fortunate to play with a lot of good players um, at each of the previous three clubs. So you know, I come to West Coast and going to give it a red hot crack and work really hard and if you work hard, train hard, you gain the respect of your teammates and the coaches and um, put your best foot forward for, for the season. West Coast Hawthorne Grand Final, big winners West Coast. Yeah, I think uh, going forward they had a, you know, she had a pretty strong year um, in the Grand Final and you know their vision going forward, they're a pretty young, pretty young group of players and a young coaching group so it was really exciting. Uh, to become a part of that um, because you know they've got strong goals and strong leaders and um, going forward they've got some good plans that hopefully will you know, see us uh, be successful in the coming years. Matt Nui taps it down, Wood grabs it, Carranza got in the way, Shuey on the way down, Matt Nui storming towards half forward, sends it long down towards the goal square, lays that train to Shepard, it runs on and on and goes through for a goal. Yeah, well, first it's good to have him as a teammate. <laughs> um, you know, playing against him, obviously his biggest assets, his centre bounce work with his uh, with his leap. So that was always a big focus on the centre bounce stuff, how to stop him there. Um, and when I would come across, it would always be against him and Dean Cox. So I mean, it was always a tough tough task against those two. Um, but it would be good to train with Nick Nat and um, to learn a few things off him because he's a very good player and um, he's got a few good assets. Uh, yeah, obviously I have to slip, slop, slap with the sunscreen. <laughs> uh, it's a bit hotter over here at the sun. Um, no, but I'm just looking forward to having a big solid pre-season. I think, you know, you, if you're on the tra training track um, each session, that, um, that's how you get fitter and you get your gains from for the season. So it's definitely getting through pre-season and improving the fitness and the strength. Um, and then obviously as we get closer to the game stuff, it's a new game plan um, coming across here, a few more tweaks and that. To other clubs, so it's learning, learning your teammates and learning the game style and um, being a part of all that and um, getting on the same, same uh, wave as everyone else.